Assalamu alaikum viewers, Munir Sand Mathematics, Munir Khan is there. Yes, today's our topic is matrices. We shall start from the basics of matrices. Actually, it is the exercise number 1.1 of matrix of ninth class. So we shall start from the definition and equal matrices, uh, rows, columns, order of matrix. So first of all, we shall start with the definition yes the definition of matrix is so simple a rectangular array of numbers or elements enclosed in square brackets uh, remember that in the definition the word rectangular array is used and we know that that is not only rectangular array that is also square array but we know that a rectangle can also be called a square that is why in the definition the word rectangular is used and the next thing that a matrix is denoted by capital letters and while the elements of matrices are represented by small letters ABC similarly the horizontally arranged elements are called rows as you are sitting in the class this is the first row this is the second and that is third and so on and while the vertically arranged elements are called columns as you are sitting there first column second column third column so the matrix have horizontally arranged elements vertically arranged elements so the order of matrix is always written as row by column if there are m number of rows in a matrix and n number of columns then the order of matrix will be m by n we can write is as m cross n also so now we shall start some examples that it is what is the order of this matrix so first of all we shall see how many rows are there here there are only two rows and how many columns are there in this example there are three columns so order of matrix will be 2 by 3 it's so simple now we shall come towards the equal matrix here an example here an example in which 1 2 is equal to 1 2 so this is equal matrix people students always says yes so i i then i explain that equal matrices are those matrices having same elements and also the same order in this example one two one two the elements are same but the order is not same so order should be same then the matrices are called equal matrices now in the end we shall go to the last question which we solve on the screen in this question we are given a matrix equal to another matrix and the first matrix having some unknown elements a b c d so we know that when the two matrices are equal their corresponding elements are also equal so we shall take first element equal to first element of other second of second of other and third element to third and fourth with the fourth so let's go to the screen since the given matrices are equal so their corresponding elements are also equal so we have four equations a plus c is equal to 0 c minus 1 is equal to 3 a plus 2b is equal to minus 7 and 4d minus 6 is equal to 2d first of all we shall take the equation of single variable i.e c minus 1 is equal to 3 so c is equal to 3 plus 1 i.e c is equal to 4 now we shall take the equation in which c is involved a plus c is equal to 0 a is equal to minus c it means a is equal to minus 4 now we shall put it in the other equation a plus 2b is equal to minus so 2b is equal to minus 7 minus a putting the value of a as minus 4 it will become plus 4 2b is equal to minus 3 and b is equal to minus 3 by 2 now for the last variable d we have the fourth equation 4d minus 6 is equal to 2d 4d minus 2d is equal to 6 
टू डी इज इक्वल टू सिक्स आई ई डी इज इक्वल टू थ्री सो आवर आंसर विल बी ए इज इक्वल टू माइनस फोर बी इज इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री बाई टू सी इज इक्वल टू फोर एंड डी इज इक्वल टू थ्री एंड इफ वी पुट दीज वैल्यूज ए इज इक्वल टू फोर बी इज इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री बाई टू सी इज इक्वल टू फोर एंड डी इज इक्वल टू थ्री इन द लेफ्ट हैंड साइड ऑफ द गिवन क्वेश्चन देन द बोथ मैट्रिस आर इक्वल एंड देन आई शैल मीट यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो विद एक्सरसाइज नंबर वन पॉइंट टू ऑफ नाइन्थ क्लास अल्लाह हाफिज़